shift to your first alert weather now. Our September warm streak continues. We have a live look outside Ooh. as well. Look at that. Mm, nice. Chief Meteorologist Albert Ramon here. Albert, that is a beautiful shot. Yeah. Temperatures near 90 again today. But we're in the ha other half of September. Yeah, this is more typical for July. We're going to be even warmer for tomorrow. We were 13 degrees above normal today at 88. We'll make it to 90 in a few spots for tomorrow, including in the loop. We could make it to 90 degrees. That is about uh, 16 degrees above average. How many 90 degree days have we had so far this summer? 21. The average year 17. We'll add that list by one at least starting tomorrow, and then we'll look for temperatures to come down slowly but surely as we head into next week. But tomorrow again, yeah, it's going to feel like July. We've got 60s in the morning, mid 80s at noon. We'll approach 90 degrees by the mid to late afternoon. Looks like we'll hit 90 around 3 o'clock. And then we'll introduce a front in the forecast on Friday. Front doesn't come in with a lot of cool air, but it could stir up a few showers. I'm not too excited on rainfall chances, nor what we're going to get in the bucket on Friday. A little bit better opportunities for measurable rainfall as we head late in the weekend. Mainly dry Saturday, better chances of rain Sunday and even into Monday of next week. So again, we made it to 88 today. A lake breeze has moved in, so we're down to 84 degrees at O'Hare, 83 at the Loop, even cooler Michigan City and Waukegan. Both spots in the 70s, but away from the lake, it's still hot at 87 degrees right now in Joliet. Nice evening with a partly cloudy sky, east wind, temperatures in the 70s through about 10 o'clock. And then overnight, those temperatures fall into the low 60s in Chicago. Low to mid 50s, though, by tomorrow morning in the suburbs. As cool as 53 Rensselaer, 53 by tomorrow morning in Aurora. But here we go again with more heat in the forecast. Lots of sunshine, upper 80s to so right around 90 degrees. There'll be a little bit of a lake influence. Lake Michigan Michigan water temperature at 73, so we'll go 83 with a lake breeze in Waukegan and 85 at the loop, about 90 degrees at O'Hare. But a lot of sunshine for tomorrow and we're dry. Now tomorrow night, a little disturbance comes in with a front. That's going to kick up a few showers, maybe even a rumble of thunder. There's 6 a.m. No big deal. A few passing showers for morning rush hour on Friday and enough instability that a few showers even possible in the afternoon as we head towards your Friday latter part of the day. And highs are still in the 80s on Friday. 80s, slight chance of rain Saturday, and then a better chance for some scattered showers and thunderstorms on Sunday. And it looks like this disturbance Sunday and especially into Monday, we'll stop the clock Monday afternoon. This would allow Allow for a quarter to maybe three quarters of an inch of rainfall. May only get a few hundreds to tenths of an inch with the stuff coming in on Friday, but a little bit better opportunity for rain in the gauge we had towards Sunday and Monday. Temperatures do not go below average. Get this until next Thursday. So we're talking about above average temperatures even for the start of next work week, albeit cooler in the 70s, 77 on Monday, 76 on Tuesday, and then finally below average about 75 for next Wednesday. Enjoy the last couple of days of the summer heat. As you know, it's pretty uh, downhill from here, <laughs> yeah. at least when we look at climatology. All right. Thank you, Albert.